All right, third times, third times a charm. Uh, this is Jesse. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make a nicely hashed map, uh, similar to what Matt Jackson and Dyson's logos makes. Um, you have to bear with me here. Uh, been having technical difficulties. So um, what we're starting out with is a simple. Uh, simple cave outline. Uh, notice it's closed up at the top. Uh, that's just for convenience sake. Uh, you can get rid of that after the fact. So what we're going to do is uh, select the fuzzy select, click outside of the map. Oops, sorry, let me get to our cave outline layer. Click outside of the map, select, and you can't see it but I'm selecting grow and I'm growing it by one pixel so it covers the line just a little bit. Um, and then I'm right clicking on the hash layer and I'm adding a layer mask and we're going to choose selection hit add and here you can see uh, over on the side here our hash uh, layer map is now black and it matches our cave system um, so let's uh, turn off the select and drag our hash map pattern right onto the hash layer right like this and oh oh it's ugly and beautiful at the same time a um, little too loud so let's go ahead and tone this down a little bit um, so what we want to do is sort of not have the entire map covered with the hash because it's just a little bit too gaudy too too much uh, so what we'll do is we'll using our fuzzy select tool again and going back to our cave outline uh, we'll select the outside um, we will invert that uh, select invert um, we'll then select grow we will grow it by 50 pixels um, and you can see here we have a nice boundary all the way around and then we're going to invert that again select invert um, and then to make it look nice and fancy we'll go to select feather and feather it by 50 pixels alright and we'll click on our hash map uh, layer mask and just drag some of this black in here like that and as you can see it made the outside disappear um, so we click back on our hash layer uh, move this opacity back up to uh, 100% and there you go quick and dirty hashing around your uh, map. It's obviously not as beautiful as the other guys, but uh, for the amount of time it takes, it works. Uh, you'll be able to get this hash map uh, pattern on DriveThruRPG uh, very shortly. Just uh, look for Morgagel, uh, M-O-R-G-A-J-E-L. Uh, while you're there, check out the brushes I've made for trees and buildings and everything else. Uh, thanks again.